so we are done with creating a link if you want you 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 can check out on the network diagram to see how it looks like so far so this is how it looks like links have been created yeah so in order for us to go back to our chat you come here then you tap on gantt chat you go back yeah. so we continue with our question we haven't completed it Another question is determine the project duration. Yeah, so we have to determine the project duration, the total project duration. So we come back to our work. In order for us to determine the the project duration, the thing the first thing that we are supposed to do is to create another row here up. So in order for us to create another row, you 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 tap on this one, the upmost row. Then you come on your keyboard, you look for the insert button, which is this one. Yeah. So once you press insert, here it changes, um, it changes and it creates a new row. So this row we shall name it total, in capital letters, total project. Total project scope. Yeah. The day we will put we put zero because it will put itself. Eh? This date I forgot to talk about it. It's the start date the start date that we put in the beginning that was given in the question. Yeah, the start date you see it's constant all over. Yeah, so the total project scope. So in order for us to, to determine the the total duration of the project, we have to indate the subtopics, these ones that, that we did not indate last time. So you come here, you we indate it, come here, indate. It becomes 1.1, .1. it was 1. And once you indent this, even these ones change. So 1.1.1, 1 .1 1 .1, like that. Eh? So even here, you come and indent the second subheading. Yeah, it becomes 1.2 instead of 2. You go to the next, you indent it. It becomes 1.3 instead of 3. You go to the next, it is, you also indent it, becomes 1.4. Then the last one, you indent it, it becomes 1.5, like that. So, when by, by, by the time you're done in indenting, there is already the total number of what? the total duration of the project, which is here, 11 days. Yeah. So the, the, the total duration of the project is 11 days. It's what we have here. And that is how we determine the total duration of the project. You create a new row, you put total project scope. Yeah, then you indent the subheadings. Yeah, by the time you're done, you already have the total duration of the project.